My mother's an educator. I had a wonderful kindergarten teacher. I remember so many things about that year, so she really planted the seed for me to want to go into teaching. Um, teacher Cadet was a lot for us. Our school is one of the first schools in the state to have that program. But the most important thing about Teacher Cadet for me was the month-long internship we had and I got to go to a second grade classroom. I started out observing and then as the month progressed, I got to take on roles, I got to teach lessons, and so that was wonderful. After um, Teacher Cadet, you know, my senior year was over, there's about a month left of high school and my administrators actually came to me and offered me a position to be an aide in kindergarten. I added it up one day and I've spent um, 200 hours in the classroom. Um, before even coming to the teacher ed program. So you really don't know what it's like in a classroom until you're actually in there. You can sit in your courses, but until you actually get to the internship portion of the course, you really don't know what it's like to be in a classroom. It's hard to describe, but when I first toured, I just felt like this is my home, this is where I need to be. So it just felt natural for me to come here. Our Making Connections class um, had the idea to uh, create a traveling suitcase for educators to get to check out and we wanted it to be official, so we've kind of partnered with some people on campus like the museum. We're putting resources in the suitcase um, that teachers can use in their classroom to educate their students on the issue of the endangered red wolves. It was a lot to do in a semester and we wanted it to be awesome, so we're still working on it. And I want to go home and teach at um, where I graduated from, so I hope that it's an encourager for other students coming along. They've seen someone come out of our school and go off to college and excel and then come back, so hopefully they'll want to do that too.